Hello and welcome to this tutorial in which I'm going to talk you through Audi's Bluetooth interface with mobile phone preparation low. First off, Bluetooth interface. It's a simple way of connecting your Bluetooth enabled mobile phone to the car's systems. Different phones will give you different functionality. A full listing can be found on audi.co.uk. From the audi.co.uk homepage, go to Owner's Area and then select Phone Compatibility. Click Mobile Phone Support and enter your phone model. The website will highlight what integration can be expected in areas like phone book access, call lists and signal strength. Bluetooth interface connects in hands-free profile only and does not include any aerial amplification or charging facility. When coupled to a multifunction steering wheel, calls can be made by simple voice commands. Mobile phone preparation low adds charging facilities through a cradle and also aerial amplification. To see a list of available phone cradles, click on Audi accessories in the owner's area and search for cradle. Adding a cradle allows you to charge your phone and gives you aerial amplification. So this is how we connect it. Press the tell button. You'll see this prompt asking to search for a new mobile phone and you'll need to make sure your Bluetooth is activated and discoverable. Click continue and the car will search for all available phones. So there we are, we found uh, both a Blackberry and my, uh, my mobile phone. So we're gonna pair up with, uh, with my one. Select the hands-free profile and the system will connect to your phone and offer a pin. Accept this and then enter the number on your phone when prompted. Once that's done, you're connected. Your phone may ask if you wish to connect automatically in the future. So every time that we get into the car, the phone will automatically connect to the car's interface. You may have an Audi which doesn't have an MMI system. And for these cars, then connecting to Bluetooth is even easier. Firstly, turn on the car's ignition. Next, on your mobile phone, search for Bluetooth devices. You'll see Audi, followed by some letters or numbers, and select it. You'll then be prompted to enter a PIN. The default PIN is 1234. Once that's done, you're connected. If the default PIN doesn't work, you'll need to contact your local Audi centre who can reset it for you. So that's it. That's how you connect your phone to the car's interface. If you need any further assistance, please don't hesitate to contact your local Audi centre.